Hi, welcome back. If you haven't been here before, my name's Lee. Okay, so today I have another question. And that question is, is the USA isolating itself over the Russia-Ukraine crisis? Now, as I've explained in another video um, on this channel, I believe that a lot of this um, one, two, three. Now, as I've explained on other videos on this channel, I think the situation between Ukraine and Russia has a lot to do with the USA. And the reason I ask this question is, I want you to take a look at this map. Now, obviously, the um, country in blue is Russia. And the countries in green are the ones that have gone along with the USA and Europe um, and imposed sanctions on Russia. But what you can see, there's a huge part of the world, most of Africa, the Middle East, China and India that have not gone along with those sanctions. So it's basically the US, the EU, Australia and a, a small handful of other countries that have um, you know, applied sanctions to Russia. And we now see that um, the US are trying to bully um, China into uh, going along with sanctions. Um, you know, you've already had the, the US try to get them to change the mind. They failed. They then sent their uh, Boris Johnson from the UK to try and convince them. Well, not sent him, but, but speak out to try and convince them. And we've recently seen India be somewhat threatened also by the USA because they've decided to buy oil from Russia. Now, the EU and the US and the UK rushed into these sanctions um, and I think they hoped that many other um, people, many other countries would follow them. And that's just not been the case because those countries are looking after their own interests. And I will do another video in the next day or so um, on my thoughts of how the uh, EU and the UK um, are going to have um, massive um, financial um, hardship over the next few years from this crisis because I think they rushed into to putting these sanctions um, on Russia. And uh, so, you know, the, the, what, what they thought would happen is they would put all these sanctions on Russia, the ruble would collapse, um, you know, th this would cause um, civil unrest and possibly overthrow um, the Putin government in Russia. Well, clearly that's not happened. Um, it seems Russia prepared for a long time for this. Um, the ruble did take a dip. It has somewhat recovered. Um, we are hearing statements from the um, finance ministry in Russia that they will uh, endure some short-term bumps in the road, but they think they have everything fully under control. So again, just I, I feel that the, the US are becoming more and more isolated. Well, the US along with the EU. Um, and I think they're going to be the ones that suffer the most, that being the, the US, the EU and the UK. Um, and I think they will, will suffer from the consequences of these sanctions long after Russia has recovered. Russia are pretty self-sufficient in many areas. Um, the, the, certainly the EU and the UK are not. Anyway, let me know what you think um, about, that's my opinion, let me know what you think. And as always, for now, take care.